The stock market can be intimidating for any of you, but it's especially intimidating for smaller companies to get a hold in that world. Luckily, Joe found someone who... You know, we hear all the time about big companies' involvement in the stock market, but you know what? Smaller, privately owned companies have a unique opportunity as well. And to share some of these opportunities with us right now is Brett Hickey, who is the CEO and founder of Star Mountain Capital. Brett, it's good to have you. Thank you so much for spending some time with us. Yeah, thanks, Joe. Pleasure to be here. You know, let me start with this question, because if anybody can answer it, you can. Why is it important to have a senior, experienced executive that's local here helping out these private businesses surrounding us? Joe, the, the key is, if you think about every big business that we know of, it started as a small business. And from an investment perspective, that's where we like to target return optimization or alpha generation is helping businesses grow from being a smaller private business to a bigger business. And to do that, we like to back and support high quality business owners, but leverage the experience that at the end of the day, as I'm sure we all know in life, sometimes learning takes trial and error and experience right. and context. And that's why we think that senior people that really have been there and done that and learned and developed the best way of doing things can add the most value to both business owners and therefore then our investors as well. That makes a lot of sense. We hear so often, you know what, it grew too fast. That business grew too fast. And, you know, you have an experienced individual like yourself and your team. You say, okay, you know what? We've been here. We've done that. Let's let's take it slower. Let's make sure that we're learning along the way. It's really smart. Yeah, and, and ultimately, Joe, there are best ways to do things and less best ways to do things. And we find that when a business owner is successfully growing their business, especially a smaller business and especially fast growth, they're already wearing a lot of hats. When we can bring the strategic insights from running large private equity firms leading and running some of the largest investment banks on Wall Street, as well as being C-level executives ourselves, running and operating businesses, the knowledge that we've gained over our team's collective few hundred years of investing in hundreds of private businesses, right. really learned, learned a lot of things in a way to really help these businesses avoid challenges and optimize on their opportunities. Well, Brett, share a little bit of that knowledge with us right now. What's the easiest way for a privately owned business to increase the value? I think there are two ways. At the end of the day, there is a large difference in valuations between a smaller private business and a larger private business still. And it all flows down from the public markets where the valuations are at all time highs. Because at the end of the day, every investor says, I want to invest in a company, take it to the next level and then sell it at a profit. And so if you think about that dynamic, the two easiest ways to grow an established private small business is either A, through making strategic acquisitions, where we really specialize in helping you find, analyze, negotiate, integrate, provide you with the financing and capital to make the investment, and then grow your business, package it up to sell with a target maximum value to a private equity firm, a larger competitor, somebody. So that's one is by making strategic acquisitions where you can grow your revenue and EBIT a lot faster and also pick up talent and other things that may be of value. Mm -hmm. The second way is really strategic organic growth. What are the right type of customers to focus on, the right geographies? What's the right product value market proposition for your business? And then where do you invest money? Because there are always 50 things or 100 things you can invest in, but what makes the most sense and in what supply order? Well, Brett Hickey, a man with a plan. Wow. The confidence that you have with this. I mean, obviously, you can certainly guide a small business along the way with, uh, with a lot of knowledge and insight and experience, like you said. So for more information, starmountaincapital.com. Reach out to, to Brett and the team. We appreciate your insight so much, Brett. Thanks for sharing with us. My pleasure, Joe. Have a great day, everybody. Next, there has been more than a year without theater. Learn how you can catch up in such a great way. This segment of It's About You was sponsored by PR Media. Behind on your bill.